is a factorial. Darn it. So a professor of mine used to use a foul word and he'd say factorial. He'd say five, damn it. So this actually reads five factorial and means that you start with five and you go down by uh, whole numbers and you multiply them together. So five times four times three times two times one is what five factorial means. So this is 20 times six is 120. The, as you get up into super big ones, this, oh my goodness, and so on. Or if I get tired, I can just sort of stop because this actually means these bits here. So if I get tired, I can just go, okay, here, this is your, the multiply out dot, dot, dot equivalent and so on. Two factorial is just two. Notice three factorial is three times two times one, which is six. And we can do a bunch of other ones. These are the interesting ones. One factorial is just one. The curious one is zero factorial. And zero factorial is defined to be, so I'm going to use three little equal bars, is defined to be one. The reason why we define it to be one is because if we put it equal to anything else, it would really mess things up. And so that's an interesting math fact that we sometimes define things to be something only because if it was anything else, it would screw everything up. So that is what a factorial is, darn it.